Hey there, how are you doing today? I'm so glad that you can make this time to check out this course. Now, AirCrete is a wonderful way to build, but it's not for everyone. I'm presenting AirCrete here because someone who works on minimum wage willing to move away from large cities can within just a single year purchase a piece of land and build themselves a starter home and live rent-free and mortgage-free for the rest of their life. And so I see AirCrete as a very uh, practical material. It lets you start or establish your life or change your life so that you can live life on your own terms. And so therefore I see it as a step one component. It's the foundational piece of building a lifestyle because I really believe that designing your lifestyle and choosing every single element of your lifestyle is absolutely critical for living to your maximum potential and having joy and fulfillment through your entire life. So if that's interesting to you, then perhaps you should check out AirCrete. Now to build with AirCrete, it's recommended that you be able to lift 92 pounds so that you can lift a bag of cement. However, that's not necessary. You can also just have your cement delivered, push it off and scoop it out. So I would say as long as you can lift at least 25 pounds, you will be capable of building your own house using AirCrete. Now, beyond that, you also have to have some balance. You know, you're going to be climbing on scaffolding and ladders as you build this up higher and higher. So it is important that you be able to maintain balance and carry some weight, perhaps 25 pounds. Um, so if you're not in great health, um, you could do this slowly. I have seen uh, a 14 year old boy build one of these, or perhaps I should say a 14 year old man because he now owns his own home. Um, I have seen a 87 year old man build his own home. So it's not an age thing so much as it is a willingness and a choice to persist at it. Because if you're willing to stick with it and persist, you will make it. If you're willing to make mistakes and then correct and fix those mistakes and learn, you're perfectly capable of doing this process. So AirCrete, I feel I would love to say it's for just absolutely everyone because I believe anyone who's willing can do it. Um, you can certainly get help from friends or family or hire help, but it's not really for everybody because not everybody's willing to build outside of areas that require building permits. Not everyone's willing to climb ladders and not everyone's willing to persist beyond making a mistake. Not everyone's willing to learn and certainly and unfortunately not everyone's willing to change their life. But hey, if you're that person who wants to change their life and you want to make the biggest difference, take the biggest step one in your life to having no rent payment and no mortgage really quickly, then check out our course. And it comes with a money back guarantee, of course. So if you check out our course and you just decide this isn't for you, please, we'll be more than happy to give you your money back because we want you to have the best experience possible. So let me outline what this course covers, what this course does not cover, and perhaps even more importantly, who this course is not for. So AirCrete is a way to build very affordable housing. It's a way to take cement and inflate it six times in volume to become an insulating structural building material. We're going to show you the tools, how to make the tools that you don't have, and how to do every single step of the process. It is not my goal to step you through an entire house build here. My goal is to take all of the knowledge that's necessary to build with AirCrete and distill it down into the most simple and concise steps, pieces, or modules, if you will, so that you understand every part of the building process and you can carry them out with understanding. It's not my goal to give you a thousand videos and 25 hours of, of training. It's my goal to give you what you need as clearly and quickly as possible. Now, with that said, and all the benefits of building with AirCrete, AirCrete may not be for you. Now, why could that be? Well, if you live in cities where it require building permits, even though 
aerated concrete is approved in the building code if it's autoclaved. The United States building codes have not yet approved homemade aircrete for building, and so it's just not likely you're going to get a permit without some real effort and engineering and further expense on your part. Okay, so what you're going to find in this course is the tools you need, how to build the tools you don't have. It's going to cover how to make aircrete as well as how to troubleshoot the aircrete. It's going to show you how to build your own foam generating machine. It's going to show you how to design your molds, how to build lasting dependable molds. It's going to cover how to make blocks for a, that you can use for building straight or round walls. And then we're going to cover the process of cementing those blocks into place using the processes that build an aircrete dome as well as arches that give you a flat surface for doors and windows. So in a nutshell, in this course, you can expect to learn all the knowledge and see the hands-on part of how to do every step of the process from conception of your foundation and laying your utilities all the way up to stacking your blocks and how to use a compass arm to generate your dome as well as using 3D software to design this before you start so that you know all of your measurements and exactly where everything goes before you ever start. And also Aircrete, the structure and the shell will cost you around eight, nine dollars a square foot to put up. And then the finishing of a house at a mid-grade level with, you know, decent materials, not cheap fake lint flooring, but actual bamboo laminate flooring and um, some low to mid-range washers and dryers and appliances. You can actually finish out a house for thirty-eight dollars a square foot. And it all depends, of course, on the materials, your location, and how much of uh, the labor you do yourself versus how much you hire out. That $38 a square foot, of course, is if you do everything. So be an overcomer, be willing to do everything, and there's no reason you can't have a beautiful, functional house affordably very quickly. So thanks for stopping by. You have yourself a wonderful, blessed, peaceful day. Namaste.